and we have been keeping a close eye on the roads for you this morning, looking for any slick spots that we've been having or any issues that might slow you down. But taking a look now in the Kansas City area, pretty good conditions right now. Nothing to worry about. No major accidents to report as of right now, thankfully. But we do want to check in with Mute Auto's Neville Miller because Neville, I know you're you got a lot of purple there on the radar. That's not good, right? Yeah, when, when my time matches the radar, that's not a good thing. Yeah, but uh, right? let me show you let me show you what's going on here. So yesterday at this time we were talking about snow today. We are talking about a wintry mix of some freezing rain and some sleet. You see around the metro a lot of purple on the map here. So from Lee Summit, Blue Springs over towards Lenexa, Olathe, DeSoto, Parkville, a little bit farther north into Platte City, getting some reports of some sleet the farther north that you go. And you see some of that darker purple closer to uh, Ottawa and just south of Olathe. That's where it's coming down just a little bit heavier. A lot of this is falling in the form of freezing rain. There may be a little bit of sleet mixing in as well, but I think that's more so as you head into the Northland. This is tracking in from the southwest right along I-35. The temperatures are very important. Thankfully, it's not quite as cold as it was yesterday at this time with temperatures in the 20s. That being said, we're still at 30 degrees in Olathe, 31 in Kansas City, Belton and Lee Summit. So just about all of us are right at or just below the freezing mark. And that's why there is that concern of seeing some potential slick areas of bridges and overpasses at least through 3 o'clock this afternoon. We're going to keep an eye on that threat for you. Freezing rain, some sleet in the mix. So an impact for today. I'll let you know when we're back up in the 40s, 50s and even 60s. That's coming up. Sounds good, Neville. Talk to you then. Thank you. Well, the clock.